Welcome to the tools section of the MOOC. We're just going to go through some of the typical tools that an archaeologist uses on site. The trowel. This is the bread and butter of an archaeologist. Use it for cleaning the trench, for defining and scooping up some of the dirt off the nice bits of the things that you find in your trench. Hand brush. This is used for brushing off masonry and other hard surfaces like brick earth. Don't ever, ever use it to clean soil because it just doesn't look very nice. The hand shovel. This is normally used when, for picking up spoil when you've been troweling and it's really useful for putting it into a bucket. We all know what a bucket's used for and there's some dirt just to show you. Here is a garden hoe. We often use this to kind of like almost trowel clean big areas. It's really useful for that. Gives you great stomach muscles and triceps. Get rid of those bingo wings, people. Here we have the spade. You shouldn't confuse it for a shovel. It's much smaller, more streamlined. It's got a great flat chopping edge. So it's really great for deturfing and also maintaining that section perfection. Here's its big brother, the shovel. This is for getting rid of that, those masses of spoil. Make sure you pick it up and you flick that spoil in one lovely arch onto the spoil heap. Then we have my personal favorite, the tool of choice. It's the mattock. So you've got this lovely flat blade for grading for digging big bits of pits and soil, and also the pick end, which I like to use for sections. And last but not least, here is the trusty wheelbarrow. It's great for collecting spoil to put on the spoil heap, but personally, I like sitting in it on my tea break and having a brew. Cheers.